In this video, I want to show you how I actually utilized Midjourney and ChatGPT to actually come up with some designs and also with other materials like text and tags for the content. And actually how I started selling some products with my designs on those products. The designs actually generated with AI, with Midjourney. I want to show you the whole process. So this is basically my online shop in Redbubble. Redbubble or these kind of websites is basically called print on demand services. Actually, you give them your design and then they put that design on all sorts of products. The products that you can choose from a long list. And when they sell one of those products with your design on that, they give your part from the profit, which is about 10 to 20 percent of the whole price. It's not bad, yeah? But before AI, the hard part was actually creating the design itself. It takes a lot of time actually come up with a good design that you can put on different products and also you need to have some description text and also some tags to actually come up with a good branding and marketing because there is a lot of competition out there so you need to somehow improve the search result for those products so let's start our shop from the very beginning and then put some products on that let's start so of course the very first thing you need to do is going to redbubble.com which is actually a print on demand services there are other services as well out there like printful or printify that you can combine it with etsy and sell those products in etsy but i myself chose redbubble because of various reasons but the platform here is not really important because i want to show you how you can actually come up with the product itself then you can put that product and design anywhere you want doesn't matter but in this video i want to go with redbubble in which i already have a shop so please go and sign up to redbubble and then start your online shop there are some steps that you can easily pass when your shop is ready you just need to go to manage portfolio and as you can see i have here a couple of designs I highly recommend to you that you go to my shop. The link is below in the description. Go there, look around, get family with the products, with the designs, with different structures. So you don't get confused when you want to start working on your own shop. And of course, if you want to order something, please do it. So here are my designs. And the good point about Redbubble is that you just need to upload your designs and then it puts your design on a long list of products. So you don't have to basically choose products one by one. So let's add new work. So here you need to upload your design, but we don't have a design yet. So let's come up with a design. I wanna use Midjourney to come up with a design. I have a lot of tutorials on how to create a design with Midjourney in my channel. So I highly recommend you to watch those videos as well. But here basically you need to search for Midjourney in Google like this. Go to the home page of Midjourney, then click on join the beta button here. And then it redirects you to Discord and you need to sign up with your email. And now you can start using Midjourney to create some designs. If you're not really familiar with Midjourney and you're really new to that, it's not necessary to create the designs yourself. You can use all the designs are already here generated by others. And the good thing about these designs generated by Midjourney is that no one has the copyright for them yet of course but basically it's generated by ai so you can use them in your designs and there is no limitation for that so this is what i want to do actually i believe this guitar is a really good design i want to go with the first one so i click on upscale one or even this one let's say upscale four and wait a couple of minutes for it to get ready and actually there is already a design so it seems interesting to me. Let me save this. As you can see, the problem with this design is that the size is 1024, which is really low for working with Redbubble. You need to have at least 2000 pixels. So a good thing we can do actually resize it with some 
Resize tools out there. One of those good websites is resizepixel.com. So upload a new image, choose 2200, I think it's good. Resize, go to download, download it. Now let's make the image suitable for printing on different products. I believe we need to get rid of the background actually. Go to an editing software like Photopia here, drag and drop your design and let's get rid of the background as much as possible so the selection tool i think works fine go with 10 let's delete everything we can Well, I think looks good enough. Just save it with PNG format. And now let's upload this design to Redbubble. Get back to Redbubble, upload new work, and choose our image. Okay, this is our design. Now, the only thing we need to do we need to come up with title, tags, and description. Well, this is a really important part. Some people just skip it, but it's really important because there is a high competition out there between different designs. So this is a way that you can actually do the marketing and improve your search result when somebody search for a type of t-shirt with some kind of design. To make it fast, I want to use ChatGPT. ChatGPT try chat GPT here so here we are so I can say that write a title about guitar and life something like this I'm not quite sure about the pronunciation well the impact of guitar on our journey let's copy that put it as the title For the tags, I only need to say that generate, I believe we need 15 tags here. So up to 15 tags. I want to use all 15 keywords. Generate 15 keywords separated with comma about the title above okay here we are copy paste it here and now description write two sentences about the title above You see, ChatGPT does all the job for you. And the good thing about ChatGPT is that the content is unique. So it will be new to Google and it's a good thing. Now, it's an interesting part. Here you can choose all the products you want to put your design on. So they have all sorts of products, all kinds of t-shirts, stickers, mobile shields, cups, mugs, notebooks, even clocks. The only thing you need to do, just choose them. So here it's already enabled. So for instance, I want to go with this notebook here. I just need to say enable it like this. And then actually you can edit the design for this specific item. Maybe I want to decrease the size and then place it at the middle. Something like this. Apply change. Now it looks better. And select no and then 
check this box off and it's good to go let's save it amazing our product is ready you can see the design is on all the products available in Redbubble let me click just on one of these products well basically you need to click on view here then we can see some of these products for instance this look at this design it's amazing but one click you're able to generate the design then put it on a t-shirt and then sell it it's amazing now you need to just come up with new designs as much as possible to actually make your shop bigger and increase your chance of selling an item to the customers. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please consider subscribing to my channel and like this video. Have a good time. Bye bye.